Just be careful now, love, love ain't simple now, love Promise me no promises, oh no, no Just be careful now, love, love ain't simple now, love Promise me no promises school supplies haul. This might seem a bit aloof for some of you. I know you're busy enjoying your summer vacation and going back to school is like the least on your mind right now. But let's face it, you don't want to miss out on all the good stuff because school supplies are being put out everywhere. Like at Target and Walmart. So it's best to shop early. So like last year and the year before that, I would wait until the first day of school to do my back to school shopping because I want to wait until I get like the supplies list from my teacher. But now that I'm going to the fifth grade, I'm most certain that the things that's needed will be quite similar to last year's and maybe just a couple of extra things needed but for the most part I have an idea of what's expected and what I need first so without further ado let's get started and hopefully this video will inspire you to get started on your back to school shopping now I went to a couple of different places and my first destination was of course Target I mean you gotta love Target right who doesn't they have almost everything there's a ton of stuff in here, so let's get to it. Okay, so the first bag is from the dollar spot. I mean, like, who doesn't check out the dollar spot when they go to Target? I mean, it's right there. The first thing that you see when you walk into Target. And I'm really excited to show you what cute stuff they have. So I got this desk pad planner. It's like a planner, but for your desktop. And it's super cute. They had like a bunch of other different styles, but I just had to get this dog and cat one. So like on the side right here, it says like weekend. And then like right here, you can like write down your homework, stuff that you need to remember, furry notes, and then perfect ideas. And when the week's over, then you could just rip it off and you'll have a fresh new page. So the next item in here are these highlighters. They're animal highlighters. They're so cute. And here's a close-up look. Aren't they just adorable? I love the cat and the dog faces on them. Then I got some more highlighters and these are for my sister. They're emoji highlighters and in first grade she'll be needing these. And these are perfect for her small hands. I also got some pencil pouches. This one's for my sister since she loves unicorns. It's super colorful. It opens on the side like this. It's pretty roomy, and then it has a tassel. I also got this kitty one for myself. It opens at the top, and here's the inside. I love the, like, the little paw right here, it's so cute. I just gotta show you these ice cream erasers. They're from the UB section, and aren't they adorable? It comes in pink, blue, and purple. Well, I think this is a teal color. Next, I got some pencil grips, and these are good to have because sometimes when you push down on your pencil, you'll get blisters, so these protect you from getting blisters. And here's a close-up look. They were only a dollar. I also got some sticky notes. You can never have enough sticky notes. So the first one that I got are these sweet design ones. These are really useful because you can mark like any page in your textbook that your teacher gives you, like an assignment so that you won't have to like flip through a bunch of pages. I got some more sticky flags. These are pretty functional as well and I really like it because it says study this on the test and yeah, it's just really helpful. I also got the cat and the dog themed sticky notes and I really like it. Um, it's actually called the best friends forever theme. I just love the shapes and they're just so cute. And the last sticky note that I picked up is these like Super cute, colorful ones. These are for my sister because she loves unicorns since it has a unicorn and like rainbows and stuff. She just loves anything that's colorful. There's also these like eraser toppers for your pencil, like just in case you don't have an eraser anymore. And they're like little stars. There's two pink ones and two purple ones. Okay, this is for my sister because she picked it out herself and it's this super cute unicorn notebook and she could just like doodle in it or like write what she needs to do. It has this super cute unicorn in the front and it's just really cute. They also have these sticker book sheets. 
here's the bag. As you can see, you get five sheets of stickers here in the design. I also picked up these awesome journals, one for me, one for my sister. The Best Friends Forever themed is mine, and this watermelon theme is my sister's. And I really like this because what journal or notebook has a pencil pouch attached to it. I mean like this is amazing to have because you can store your pencils in it, your colored pencils in it, just about anything. And the pages are blank. All right, the next two stuff that I'm about to show you are one of my favorites. I got these two pouch sets. They're really cute. This one is the Best Friends Forever theme and this one's the watermelon theme for my sister. So I really like these because like the pouch is see-through, it has some glitter in it. Let me show you the inside. So it comes with like this sticker sheet right here, this doodling booklet, and this is my favorite. It comes with a mechanical pencil and a gel pen, and it also comes with an eraser, but it looks like a lipstick. How adorable is that? Let me take it out for you guys. Here's what the eraser looks like. It can go up and down just like a lipstick. It comes with this mechanical pencil. Here's the pen and I really like it because it has a heart cut out. Now the watermelon one is similar to the one that I showed you but in a different design and it also comes with the lipstick eraser. Then I got some sharpeners, they're watermelons. The front's super cute, here's the back. There's two in it so one's gonna be for me and one's gonna be for my sister. There are also pencils at the dollar spot, and as you can see, this side is the unicorn and rainbow one, and the other side is the Best Friends Forever theme. And I think this will go great with the pencil grippers and the pencil toppers. Then I also got these Framable Arts. Um, I'm not planning on using them for like walls. I'm planning on using them for like my binders because you can just slip this in the binder pocket or you can punch holes in them and make dividers for it. Here's this other one. It's a smaller version. The back. And it just comes with a bunch of cute designs. So if you guys wanna see a DIY video on how I use these, then comment down below. I also got another thing to decorate, but it's like for a locker. It just says be yourself with a bunch of hearts. The last and final thing in this bag are these binder booklets. I love the rose gold on the side. It says ideas right here. I can just like jot down ideas, write down what I have for homework. And they're already hole punched so I can put it into my binder. On to the second bag, which are items that I got from the school shop area. So I got this book cover and my school requires book covers because we have to protect the textbooks since we're not keeping them and we're just borrowing them. So I got this really cute pattern. I love the pink and the blue. Then I got these pack of Sugar Rush pens. These are like amazing, they, they come in two sets. So I can give this first set to my sister and the second set to me. Here's a close up look of it. These are actually scented gel pens, which I'm really excited about because they smell like candy. It has a medium tip of 0.7 millimeters with soft comfort grips. I also got some more highlighters and the reason why I'm getting a lot of highlighters is because I go through highlighters like nothing. My school, we highlight so much, so it's good to stock up on them this year. Here's a close-up look. They're these Sharpie Clearview highlighters. I got these last year, and I just had to get them again this year. Then I had to pick up some glue sticks because these are required as well. These are the disappearing purple glue sticks that everyone loves. I also got these high polymer eraser caps, and I love high polymer erasers because they erase super well and they won't tear your paper. Here's a close-up look. I'm really excited about these. I got some Papermate Inkjoy pens. And at my school, they require us to have a black, a blue, and a red pen. So why not get the whole entire pack? This is a 0.7 millimeter medium point. Then I got some more pens, and these are actually for my mom. Look how ultra fine it is. It's a 0.38 millimeter. And these are really hard to find. When my mom saw it, she just snatched it up right away. Then I got this mechanical pencil. These are pretty expensive. Last year I got a three pack and I lost them all because I lended them to people and never got it back, which is why my mom told me that I can only get one and if I lose this, then I'm not gonna get another one. But anyways, 
Here's a close up look. It's a 0 0.7 millimeter and it's super high quality. Okay, so I also got this super cute panda glue. They actually have these at Target and this was the last one. It was like meant to be for me because I love pandas. Then in the UB section of the school shop, I got this mini supply kit. It's very compact, it's so cute, and it's pink. Let me show you what's inside. Here's the inside. As you can see, it has the hole punch, stapler, stapler remover, tape dispenser, pencil sharpener, scissors, staples, and tape. The final thing in here is the stapler. I didn't know that I was gonna get a stapler in here, so this is going to be my for my sister. Look how cute it is. It's purple, it has polka dots, and on the bottom it's blue. There's also this keychain right here so you can attach it to your backpack. Moving on to the third bag. So I got these folders. I really like this one. It's a black gold foiled polka dotted one. Here's a close up look. And here's the inside. It's just like a normal folder. And then this one is my sister's. She picked it out herself. It totally matches with her backpack because it's a unicorn. I really like the sparkly ombre effect. As you can see, it goes from blue to pink. Here's the inside. And then right here, it says glitter glam. I also got some composition books and of course I'm going to be needing composition books. So I got this really cute pastel donut one with gold foil. As you can see, it's super cute. Here's the back. And then I got this other one, which is a cupcake. Again, it has gold foil. Here's a close-up look. I really like these composition books. They're so pretty, and I just love the gold foil and the pastel colors. And they're college ruled. And, of course, I had to get a notebook. So why not get a cute one? It's this sparkly donut one right here, and it says, Donut, you know you're awesome. It has a kawaii face. I just love it. It's so adorable. And on the back, it still has some more like food with kawaii faces, and it's wide rolled. I don't mind wide rolled. I mean, like, I don't care at all. So yeah, here's a close up look. Another requirement I'm sure I'll need is a binder. So I got this pink rose gold pineapple one. It's super pretty. I love the rose gold. Here's the inside. It's a one inch binder. Here's the pockets, and I just love the pink stripes. You cannot have a binder without index dividers, so I got these like gold foiled dotted ones. It has five of them, and I'm planning on like decorating these just to add some more like stuff to it. But if you want to see a back to school DIY video, then comment down below. And I'll show you like how to decorate your binder and other stuff. So that is it for my Target haul. All right, so I also went to Office Depot since it is in the same shopping complex as Target. And last year they had the most cutest supplies. So this year I had to check it out. So here's what I got. This first thing here is a ruler. And this kind of reminds me of a plain ruler but like with 3D stickers on it. So if you already have a plain ruler, then go to Michael's or Target and get like 3D stickers and put it on so that you won't have to get a new one. I have this plain ruler right here and some 3D stickers. So this is what it would look like. It'd be a macaroon ruler. So that's just an idea. Oh, and look you guys, this matches with my donut notebook that I got at Target. This totally matches, right? And then I got the best erasers ever. They're the high palmer erasers. And the reason why I got two is because there was a sale going on so I can get two for $4. Here's a close up look. And as you can see, there's a protective sleeve. But if you don't like this sleeve because it's like boring, not your style and it's plain, then what you can do is take some washi tape, wrap it around the sleeve and it'll look something like this to suit your style or coordinate with your school supplies. I also like them in the retractable style, so I had to have these. And the reason why I'm stocking up on erasers is because I go through them like crazy. So this will probably last me like my whole entire elementary year. Through, you never know, but it might last me through junior high. 
So here's a close up look. Next I got these amazing scented markers from Mr. Sketch. I've been wanting these for so long. Last year, everyone in my class had them and now I have my own set. Here's the back, they smell so good. And it just has all the scents. And then I got my sister the six pack and it just has like the normal rainbow colors since she doesn't need that much. Here's the back. Another requirement are scissors. I had some last year, but I don't know what happened to it. So I got this new pair and it just has a silhouette of someone doing gymnastics. It's pink and it has a little gem right here. And that's all for what's inside this bag. Now moving on to the second bag. All right, so I got some more book covers since my school does require us to have two or three. I got this red one because it'll coordinate with my new backpack, which I will show you in my justice haul. And then I got this pink one. I just really like the color pink, so here's a close-up look. And these get sold out pretty quick, so I had to stock up on these. Then I got some more composition books. They had like the most cutest composition books, so I had to stock up on them. This first one here, I really like the color combination. It's like mint with gold foil. And this one's college rolled. Then I got this one. It's pink stripes with like heart gems on it and it's glittery. This one's wide roll. I also got this unicorn one for my sister. It has like a really cute unicorn on it. This is wide rolled as well. I really like the unicorn one, so I got one for myself too. Next, they had these soft colored notebooks that I love. So, I got two. This first one right here is a hexagon with gold foiling, and then there's a pink hexagon in the middle. And this last notebook here, it's pink and the gold foil says notes. And that is all for this Office Depot haul. some stuff that I got through Amazon Prime. This is like super affordable, the shipping super fast, and I just like shopping here because there's some stuff that you can't get anywhere else. So let me show you what I got. First off, I got this like pencil pouch, but like there's so much room for like colored pencils. Let me show you what it looks like on the inside. So this first compartment is different from the last three. So this can hold like your highlighter, your eraser in here, or extra lead mechanical pencils and then this side right here it can hold like pens colored pencils anything that fits in here and like I mentioned before the last three are different so let me show you the second one both sides are the same so these can hold like 72 colored pencils including the three and the reason why I got this is because I like this better than the normal pencil box and the reason why I like it more is because look how messy this is. This is my old pencil box. As you can see, I have to dig through colored pencils to find the color that I want to use. And this isn't that secure, so I end up losing some of my colored pencils and pencils. This isn't organized too, so all of my pencils and colored pencils are mixed in together. That's why I think this is a better system for me. I also like how this is plain so I can like design it or style it which is why I got two more so that I can show you guys how to do that in a separate DIY video. So make sure you hit that bell notification button down below. It's right next to the subscribe button so that you won't miss that video. Next I got some colored pencils and these are the crazy art ones. I could get like the Crayola ones but I want to give crazy art a try. I mean like these look like they're good quality. I mean, it says it's long lasting, easy sharpening, and it has thick, smooth blood. So I cannot wait to try this out. And best part of all, it has 72 different colors. Plus, it's also sharpened. So again, I cannot wait to try these. Okay, so this isn't for school, this is for home, but I got this electric sharpener because it works super well, it's fast, and I don't have to like keep cranking and cranking. So that's why I got this. It has an ultra durable steel blade and it auto stops once it's sharpened, like your pencil's sharpened. Plus the ratings were pretty high on Amazon. Last but not least, I got this huge unicorn eraser for my sister. Look how huge it is. 
Hello, it's bigger than my hand, but it's still cute. Here's a close up look. I don't even know how my sister is gonna like erase with it, but I thought this would be fun for her to have, so yeah. That's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, hit that notification bell so that you won't miss my Justice Haul and my DIY videos, which will be coming up after this. And I'll see you guys later. Bye!